Hello. Guess what? Believe it or not, I tried taking all of them out. They're all stuck. I somehow got this one out. So hopefully I can take those out. So far, I have two. Yes. I'm gonna move Martha over there. Much better. Oh my god. Look at that. Can't even take it off. There we go. Hey, so the inside is fine, right? Um, I. Bro, if you're watching this video, thank you so much. Good news, I got all the locking, locking key nuts, locking nuts off. Bad news, I. Uh, it's a little ugly. Shout out to you, man. I love you. I don't want to put these on for a while until I get my new wheels or until I get the key. The guy that I bought the car from said he emailed it to me. It's been a week now. I haven't gotten them. Then I told my friend that he had them. So I asked him today if I can borrow them. He said yes. And um, shout out to him. I can finally paint these very ugly wheels. Hello. I'm very excited for this, but we're painting Martha's wheels finally. Look at how ugly these are. This is awful. It's plastic dip peeling out. Whoever had these wheels did an awful job plastic dipping. But these are not bad. The front ones, eh, they're okay. But we're gonna fix them up. Took off the lock nuts. I've been driving Martha with literally three lugs. No bad, don't do that, but I gotta do it. Let's remove the lugs. Each lug has like a little hump on it, so this little socket is too short. It's not, it's too wiggly, so it's not going to work out. Meantime, we're going to be installing these. Turning signals and low beams. And they also work for high beams. This should not be a hard install. Okay, so right here I put on one of the low beams. One of them. Out. Why is it going? I found out why they're not fitting. Those two plastic lines right there. There's only one in the middle. So when I was trying to put it on, it made a dent in the middle. But at least I can try to put on one of the turning signals. Hell yeah, that one works. But for here, there's only one plug, which I don't... It's supposed to have like this other piece on it. Found my old one. Well, both of my turning signals work. I just need to get some new headlights. Well, I gotta return these and get a, the ones that actually fit. I'm dumb. I, ordered, I got the wrong one. I got the 9006, but I'm supposed to get these. Hey, we got the lights working. I thought the middle was the low beam, but no, they're the high beam. So happy. Hi. I use my turning signal. It doesn't go super fast. Like you can see it working. Oh. Headlight done. Yeah. No, Kevin, all done.
Hello, a couple days later. So I'm almost out of time, but real quick, we're gonna fix the windshield. There's tape on it, some really disgusting old tape. We're gonna be taking that off with a razor blade. Well, this crusty old scratch it right off because the razor blades won't really scratch the glass. Okay, I got most of the tape off. Look at that. You can see the cracks, but not. Well, there's still tape, but I'm out of time, so we will resume. Oh, uh, yeah, babe. Hello, Max. Hello. All right, so Max was here. As you can see, we're getting out the tools because we're going to be taking out the wheel and repainting them, dipping them. So let's just start on taking out the wheel. I take out the jack stand from the Jetta. Enjoy the time lapse. Got one side lifted. We're taking out the wheel. So I have two half empty cans of plastic dip and this half full spray paint. I'm gonna use up what I don't have that much of. The front wheels are not so bad. It's a little bit of chip. We plastered it most of the spot. Uh, it looks pretty bad, but the spray paint will do the job. <laughs> Any words? Nah, not really. It's good. Update soon. Okay, I'm inside, obviously. Good news, I painted all the wheels. The car looks great, but one more thing happened. Mother Nature decided to totally take a dump on us. Supposed to be a tornado warning, but more like a thunderstorm. Shout out to my friend Max and shout out to Raul for coming. I didn't film a whole lot because I was just trying to get focused on getting the wheels done right. All I basically did was plaster dip like four or five coats and then I put spray paint. I put like three layers of spray paint. So as you can see, it's another day. Very sunny, not rainy. It's supposed to rain like all this week, but it's not raining. So let's fix this crack while I still can. Simple. This is a little kit. I have me some glass cleaner. It's a very small clean. This is the kit I'm using. Uh, windshield with cracks, the chips. Look at that, it opened. I'm gonna press like that. Try to move it along the crack. You wanna put some slippery, like grease, something that's slippery enough. And you put the suction cup, they work, and you can still move them. Okay. I'm using lotion because I know what I have. Hello. So as you can see, a couple days later, the day I finished painting the wheels, started to rain really bad and thunder. Gotta stop filming and this video is taking too long to finish. It's been like two weeks I've been trying to film this video. There were three main things I wanted to get done. First thing was fix the headlights completely. I got that. Second thing I wanted to do was paint the wheels. Now they look beautiful. 
Muscle looks amazing now. That and the last thing I wanted to do was push this crack. But I, I didn't even do it right. I only got like one small section fixed and the rest is still cracked. I don't feel like taking or waiting longer. I used up all the... Got two good things done. Hopefully I'll do the windshield again or nah, I'm gonna have to just buy a new one. Martha looks good. You guys look good too. And I wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry it took so long to post this video. Please press that like and subscribe. Yeah.